Well, just finished my first live stream. Um, I hope it was enjoyable. I hope that the sound came through okay. Uh, so now let me get to the cards of the day and let's see what they have to say today. Oh, mercy. As you can hear, I'm still croaky from the flute festival. Actually, it was from playing flute in the evening. Some of the people at the hotel. <laughs> I went out to play a little music with Sachi, you know, to and people from the hotel came out and unfortunately they were all smoking and I cannot be around smoke for a second. I just get, uh... but they were smoking and uh, so I'm still the residuals of their smoke. So first card out is Flamingo Spirit. Embrace the in-between. <laughs> I love the flamingo with the feather on his head <laughs> with her little flamingo hat embrace the in-between <laughs> enjoy whatever it is that you have okay Oop. got an extra card in there okay let's see what our next card out is today efficiency be efficient in what you are doing Okay. Efficiency is good when you're not trying to expend too much energy. So be efficient in that. And hopefully I learned to be efficient in doing a live stream. <laughs> oh, Lord, have mercy. Uh -huh. So let's see what we have here. Next card out is the Council council <clears throat> oop there you go you see it's sort of the council you know it's always good to have council when you are a little bit uh, not sure what direction to have what direction to go you can always go to somebody that's been there first <clears throat> and they can be a road map and try to help you, but you always have to make your own decisions on everything. It's what I tell my students when they come and say, Guruji, what should I do? I say, don't look at me. This is your life, not mine, and you have to live with the consequences of your actions. So don't ask me to tell you how to live your life. You have to live it yourself. Next, we have immersion. You got to jump right in. The water's fine. You know, same thing, like this is my first live stream. You had to just jump in, you know, and go for it no matter what happens. <laughs> it's like when I put the music up. I haven't heard this music before. All the music you see me doing, that's a first take. That's it, you know. You, you put it up, and it's improvisation. You just go with the flow of it. And... Um, <clears throat> That's what I like about Native American flute. It's you, you just go with the feeling of it. And, uh, you know, it, it, that's the way that rocks. You just got to go with the feeling, uh, get in tune with the music, and, and let it go. <clears throat> oh, somebody asked me about my playing. I've been playing since June. So five months I've been playing Native American flute. And how did I get involved with it? I was left. I was supposed to uh, talk with somebody, and I went on my journey, and uh, I ran across the flute, picked it up, and that's, that's it. I, I just started to run with it. Next is Ten of Fire, Oppression. <clears throat> You know, we all always have some kind of an oppression or something come along that we're going to have to deal with. You know, but it's like anything, if this too will pass. So try not to get too upset when you have uh, a moment of oppression, something's not working out, you know, or, um, you know, you have to wait it out. Um <clears throat> You have to sometimes stand up, 
Sometimes you have to wait it out, and sometimes you have to be a trail maker. This is like the uh, chariot card in, in other decks, but the trail maker. You have to push forward, okay? You have to push forward no matter what it is. It's the same thing like flute, you know? When I picked it up, I just practiced all day, all day, all day. I just kept uh, going with it. You know, and if you want to learn something, that's what you have to do. You have to put the time in with it. <clears throat> you have to put the time in and just keep going until it becomes natural. And last but not least is cave, is sanctuary. You know, find a place where you have a, a feeling of safety, your place of sanctuary, uh, like I said, you always have a place of sanctuary with you in every moment. That's the heart center, okay? If you become your best friend, okay? And it doesn't matter if you're in a crowd of people. If you're alone, you're always with yourself no matter what, okay? You could be alone in a crowd of people, okay? <laughs> you can learn to be alone but not lonely. Befriend yourself, find out what a great person you are, okay? So let's go through the cards again one more time. Embrace the in-between. You know, it doesn't always have to be one way or another way. You know, embrace the in-between as well. Again, efficiency. Don't waste a lot of external and extraneous energy, okay? The council. Okay, take counsel when needed. You know, it, you can always get counsel. You either use it or you don't, but be open to having counsel when needed to aid you on your journey. Immersion, you got to really jump in if you're going to get anything done. Have your sanctuary, the cave of the heart. You can always go there. Be a trail maker. Okay, it, that takes, again, getting out there and just doing it to move forward. And when there is oppression, remember, this too will pass. Okay, so there we have the cards of the day. And thank you, everyone, for tuning in. I hope you've enjoyed these. So I am going to go ahead and put this up and then get to the readings. I think somebody was asking about Mitch McConnell reading this morning. So let me get to that. Thanks for being online. I will see you online. Have a great day. Aho! And it's today is Wednesday, November 14th. See you online. Aho!